Hello everybody, welcome to the United Way. My name is Rahab Dukan and yeah, this is our preview Manchester United South Taunton or I would say South Taunton Manchester United preview. I want to tell you guys, guys, my uh, scores, my lineup, my opinion about the game and I would love you guys to get your views as well. And guys, as usual, please help our community. Click the like on the video. If it's your first time here, please, please subscribe to the channel. Always like the videos for those over here, subscribe. I know I haven't been doing live streams of late, but guys, I have a serious problem here. I could explain to you, but nobody cares except Van Hoist. But anyway, well, I'm, but I'm going to do a video actually about that. So yeah, Manchester United, um, we are playing against South Taunton. We are moving South Taunton. That's, a, that's an early game, you know, yeah, this weekend. And uh, United, this is a game in which we are playing against an opponent, which is technically like us in a position that they just have one goal uh, in three games, one point in three games. And... They are just a beatable team. In the, in the normal P, uh, EPL sense, this is a game which United has. It's a three-point game. The question would have been, how do we win the game? I remember some years ago, I think six years ago, United had a record. Was it 11-1 or 9-1 win? Was it Ole Gunnar Solskjaer? I don't know. Someone should tell me in the chat. Uh, we beat uh, South Anton in their pitch and their manager was sacked. And guess what? With all what we are listening about Ten Hag and the negativity on the press, if United loses against South Anton, the tables could turn to Manchester United. And Ten Hag might be having that pressure, that massive pressure of being sacked. Because look, if you cannot beat a team, which is the last in the league, a team that has scored just one goal, then what do you expect from, uh, from the board or from the fans? Or, I mean, I think it's, it's fair, fair play to, to start quarrelling. But yeah, so uh, to, the good news is United, they were back on training yesterday, guys. I, I mean, I read all the news. I, I'm in a difficult situation. I, I don't need to cry. I'm not a kid. But uh, they, I mean, I read all news and I know what's going on with the team. I speak to folks here in the UK, people who are diehard United fans. I meet them every day. And um, yeah, and um, I, 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 yeah, I think we are going to do a good job. The way United has to go into this game the, uh, is... Um, let me just put it this way. The biggest question I've been asked about this game by United fans here in the UK is, should Ogati start the game? And uh, I want to tell you why. I'm not the manager, but I want to tell you guys why I think Ogati should start and why I think he shouldn't start. And uh, you guys should make your mind. And please, that's the question of the video. Should Ogati start? Don't say yes or no, please. Just tell me why you think we start. How it's going to influence our playing style. It's very important for those of you who are United fans. Guys, if you come here for me, you can unsubscribe. Come for a Manchester United stuff. We are here talking about football. If it was about me, I would uh, block this. I mean, I would just... I'm in a situation which I could just block this channel. It doesn't mean anything. But uh, I'm a fan and I come here. I want to meet people who are football-loving people. That's, 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 that's all about this. That's what we, we do here. That's all. Yeah. And if we build a, a, build a bigger community, that's why I, I start bringing people into the, the, the community and we build something massive. It never starts by you going from 1 to 10. You have to take the stairs. I, ho I just want to believe I'm dealing with smart people here. Anyway, yeah, so United starting the game. I think uh, a game where United must win. This is a must win. So how do you start? How do you think United should line up in this game? We know we are playing against a game in which in a club which we are superior to this club. South Anton, we are superior. So we have to go with total confidence. Forget about the losses we had. We had... Uh, we had an okay game against Fulham, a good game in which we lost against uh, Brighton, in my view, and a, a, a catastrophic game, in my view, against Liverpool due to the tactical, uh, um, uh, uh, to, due to the bad tactics from our manager, actually. And, but this game, he needs to get it right. So this is how I'm going to start. Let me give you my lineup. I think Onana starts again. The two central back, Delete, uh, De who had a first good game, but a bad game also. Uh, I watched the game. Uh, um, a bad, a first game which was oh, agreeable, not good, but he was relaxed. He was rested the next game. And uh, we, I want him to play with Lisandro Martinez, who will be key. Playing away from Manchester United, we are the team to, be, to beat. Some people think it's City. We are the team to beat. If you want to make pop, if you want to get your club popularity, especially in the foreign market, you need to win Manchester United when they come to your stadium, because these games are more. Uh, your, that will be the most watched game by uh, Southampton this season in his stadium. So just to put that, uh, just put that in context. 
Yeah, so in the left, I will start with Delo. I'll basically start the, with Delo on the left, on the right, Mazwari, which I think uh, he, he, uh, he played the first game with Morocco. He was rested at the second game, in my view. Yes, I mean, that was it, yeah, he was in the second game. Then coming on the midfield, yeah, holding midfield. You know what? I told you about this, my, um, starting um, Ugate or keeping him. I will start Ugate with the fact that we have to have a, a game plan that in the first half we are leading that game and winning. Because if we go to Southampton to score us, it will be very difficult for us to come back. Because it's not about the football, guys. I've had uh, Tunde Joy who has said, oh, we don't play good football. Our players go to national team and play better. They don't play Manchester United the same way. It's not necessarily that. The problem is players, they play for... They play for a weaker tournament. The Premier League, the weakest team in Premier League has a good lineup than most teams in the in in the European Cup, you know, because they have a better option to buy players and the, the best players in the position. So try to think about the, that 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 view because many people have been talking about online. So I will start Ogate in case we are uh, we have to go in, in case the game plan is that we go on a very high press beat the press and we can score at least two goals in the first half leading the game then maybe we bring Casemiro to hold the scores in the last I mean in the 60th minute Ogate cannot play full games that's when so I'll start Ogate personally in front of him Kobe Meno who was rested in the last game also in England we have Bruno Fernandez Mr. Every Game we can, I think I'm expecting Bruno to have a very good game and look the nine are a look I mean you know what in the nine position, I will put, um, I will put, uh, I will play with uh, uh, the Nigerian Dutch player Inzerski. And guess what? In the left, I know they have put Rashford a lot in training. They have I've seen some of his video, keeping his fitness. Some will say he's doing that just to big up his profile, you know. But I know he's training to to be in good shape. I will put, I will keep Rashford. I will bring Rashford in, in my view. And uh, I will start on the, on the left, I will put Ganacho. Yes, there have been some issues with Ganacho. He was international duty. He did like an Instagram post uh, when, or, or an Instagram, a video, a social media video of Cristiano Ronaldo. And uh, the fans were saying, oh, that Harry Tenak is going to punish him. But we shall see. But this is football. Look, footballers have, um, they have a life to live. They have to be disciplined. But... Um, I think so in the in the in the world of social media I think uh say Alex Ferguson would have struggled with some players also especially a player like David Beckham if there was really social media and back then anyway so yeah so um I will put Ganacho in the left and I will start with um the, uh with Ahmed in the right Ahmed also on the right so that's my lineup guys tell me what you think drop your lineup below I want to get your lineup I'm going to reply your lineup we are going to have a chat and uh, I'm going for Manchester United to win three goals to one. I just don't see United playing a game um, without conceding a goal. But we have to go with a game plan. The game plan has to be there from, I mean, if there is no game plan, then we are going to, be, we are going to lose that game. And some of you who are just football fans who have watched United a lot and complaining about United not winning games. United is the team that every team has to beat want to beat in order to to not to kick off the season in order to to prove themselves right so whenever united this is what these players need to know because if we fans know that these players need to know the reason why they are highly paid in united than other clubs is because we are a team with a high prestige it seems as if this hasn't gone down into the in the minds of the players the players the players don't really know this i think they should be somehow it's a ceremony where players are really introduced on clubs when they sign for clubs united is a different animal when it comes to all the all these issues so uh guys that's my lineup drop your lineup below smash a like on the video get involved with the united way i've just been had a question from van hoys asking if i was going to be live i'll explain you guys do a short video explaining guys why i haven't been live all this while uh and um, and I will be live only in the next in the future. I'd have no clue. I mean, I'm in a difficult. It has something to do with financial. It has something to do with legal also. So let's sort these things out. If uh, we sort them out, I will get back to you guys. I can't say it yet. It's um, it's 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 a life threatening thing, honestly. So uh, yeah, but I'm not a criminal. I never, I never, I never hurt somebody, stole somebody something. So you should, you should take that to 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 court. But anyway, guys, smash like on the video. Get involved, United Way. I'm going for three one United. What are you going out for?
guys please share the video and uh, yeah talk to you soon bye bye